Isaac and his mother lived alone in a small house on a hill. Isaac kept to himself, drawing pictures and playing with his toys as his mom watched Christian broadcasts on the television. Life was simple, and they were both happy. That was until the day Isaac's mom heard a voice from above. Your son has become corrupted by sin. He needs to be saved. I will do my best to save him, my lord, Isaac's mother replied, rushing into Isaac's room, removing all that was evil from his life. Again, the voice called to her. Isaac's soul is still corrupt. He needs to be cut off from all that is evil in this world and confess his sins. I will follow your instructions, Lord. I have faith in thee, Isaac's mother replied as she locked Isaac in his room away from the evils of the world. One last time, Isaac's mom heard the voice of God calling to her. You've done as I've asked, but I still question your devotion to me to prove your faith. I will ask one more thing of you. Yes, Lord, anything, Isaac's mother begged. To prove your love and devotion, I require a sacrifice. Your son Isaac will be this sacrifice. Go into his room and end his life as an offering to me to prove you love me above all else. Yes, Lord, she replied, grabbing a butcher's knife from the kitchen. Isaac, watching through a crack in his door, trembled in fear. Scrambling around his room to find a hiding place, he noticed a trap door to the basement hidden under his rug. Without hesitation, he flung open the hatch, just as his mother burst through his door and threw himself down into the unknown depths below. And welcome, this is Balloscopo with another random game. This is going to be The Binding of Isaac. Now, this isn't a long enough game for an entire Let's Play, so I'm going to be doing this um, in random videos. If I have to come back to it, I have to come back to it. Hopefully, though, I can defeat it very quickly. However, I'm not very good at the game. Uh, let's move on here and just head down here. Uh, for those of you that don't know the game, it is a uh, popular indie game uh, from the same guys that brought you uh, Super Meat Boy. So let hopefully there's a uh, sort of some repeats here. Now you want to take out pretty much everything that you can on every floor, hoping that you can get some good items. What the hell is all that? Are you kidding me? You see that rock way over in the corner there? That's a special rock with items in it, but I am not willing to go through enough bombs to get it. And now we've got mindless Isaac's chasing us, uh, as you can see from. Uh, opening uh, video that I showed. This game is pretty messed up, uh, but hopefully you guys still enjoy its its level of depravity. Uh, these are power-ups. They always come up in the gold rooms here. I see a needle. It's a needle of some kind. Is he going to inject it himself? The virus! Oh, God. Now I've got poison on my arrows, which are tears, by the way. I'm attacking everything with my tears. Uh, let's head over here. Um, oh, great. This doesn't look good at all. Especially that guy up there. No. Damn it. Down he goes, though. Down he goes. Did not like the looks of that guy. No. Stay away. Stay away. Don't, don't hit me. No. 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 I swear, I play this game more like I'm dodging than I'm actually trying to attack. I think that is the proper strategy, though. I would rather avoid getting hit than, uh, than hit the other guy and get hit. If that makes sense. Whoa! He just suddenly exploded on his own? What about you? You die in a troll bomb, too. Damn your troll bombs! And we have already made it to the boss room, and I haven't lost any life yet. 
So this is looking good for me so far. But in here we find Larry Jr. You guys remember Larry from uh, Super Meat Boy? His son is here. Hooray. No, stay away. I don't have very many power-ups, just the poison. But I don't know if poison affects uh, bosses. Stay, you know, stay away. Damn it. Just stay as far away as you can. Well, I can still hit you. Damn it. I'm just hitting rocks now. Damn it. Stay away. Don't hit me. No, no, no. no. You guys are trying to surround me. I'm on to you, Larry. Larry Jr. How? Damn it. Wait. Did I poison? I thought... I thought poison... Damn it. I th no, whenever he hits me, he gets poisoned. I see. I see. That's that's an interesting power-up. Why would I want that? When he hits me, I get hurt. And is he almost gone? Down he goes. Give me my life back. All the poop is gone. It goes away in a smiley face. I don't know if you guys can see that. All right, let's grab this. What, what, what power-up is this? The pentagram. <laughs> ah, now I've got horns and damage up tears do look bigger do they look bigger i think they do and we've already made it to the next basement oh no why there's no toilet paper ah give me my horns back ah stay away okay no damn it i got hit no no so this game is a lot of fun. The controls are a little weird until you get used to them. Uh, you do have to play for a little bit before you get used to them. Uh, uh, wow. The layout is very similar to uh, the old school Zelda um, layout. Uh, especially the NES ones. Link to the Past, I believe, had the same format. I'm sure they've gotten rid of that by now, though. Uh, to be honest, I don't have a Wii, though, so I couldn't tell you for sure. But I'm pretty sure Zelda doesn't use uh, this layout for dungeons anymore. Alright, troll bombs, go away. Give me those coins. Uh, coins are useful in the shop. Uh, however, I rarely go into the shop because I can rarely find anything good in there. Let's avoid the boss for now. Ah, damn it. Envy. Alright, how are you going to attack? Envy. We're up against the seven deadly sins from time to time here. He's not... He's not really doing anything. Really? He's not... Oh, there we go. He splits up. And let's take on one of those. Now... How many times is he going to split up? Damn it. This is why you, you only want to take on one at a time. Stay away. There you go. Just split. That's his. That's his modus operandi. Hello. Uh, damn it. See. One more. This guy's still going. What the hell? The life bar is all gone. And let's take on. No. Damn it. Take you on. Now the little one. Take on the little one. I don't want my screen to get flooded with these little guys. Damn it, they're hard to hit, too. And they're just going in a straight pattern, too. I don't know what my problem is. Alright, grab that. I don't know if there's a point to fighting the mini-bosses. Um, because as far as I can tell, you don't usually get a very good item at the end of it. Alright, and there went my shield. That was what I picked up earlier, the blue uh, little heart thing. Alright, and then here... I don't know what that is. Is it like a glass of water? Chocolate milk! Charge shot. I can, like... Chocolate milk! Nice. That, that is a good power-up. I like that one. Alright, let's load one up. Looks like I'm hucking the loogie, though. Uh, nothing in here. Die! Nice. Die! Damn it! But then if I miss, that's awful. Alright. There's a lot more to this level. I like this level. Yeah. Damn it, I hit the poop. Don't hit the poop! Oh, he was going to kill himself anyway. Oh, it doesn't like 
disappears. It doesn't go through. Alright. Go, chocolate milk! One hit. Oh, how'd that miss? Alright, stand still. Hooray. Ooh, treasure chest. Nice. Anything in there? Okay. Let's move on. Over here. Oh! Jeez. Wow, look at that. I'm wrecking a house with this chocolate milk eyes. Well, not eyes anymore, because I'm, I'm spitting them now. They're not coming out of... No. They're not coming out of uh, my eyes. They're coming out of my mouth. All right, what do you got in the shop? Um, all right, uh, I do need a key. I don't think I need a bomb just yet. Oh, what's this? The treasure map. Oh, there's something up here. Let's bomb that then. And it opens up a door! What's in here? Um, can I... Can I do anything with you? Okay, what's this? What's this? Oh, I don't have any money. It's like a slot machine. Can I bomb it? I can! Now I get some coins. And a bomb back. Alright, so there we go. Treasure room. Now we can take on the boss with my charge shot. I could use another heart, you know, half a heart, but I don't see one around, so I'll just avoid that for now, I guess. Alright, into the boss room. Isaac versus the Duke of Flies. This doesn't look good at all. Charge up. Charge up my laser! And just whip it. Damn it. There we go. I'm hitting, I'm hitting the flies more than I'm hitting him, so charge shot is not good for this guy. And he occasionally launches like a big one at me, but these guys are all defense, I assume. And I do see that thing over in the corner. I will bomb that once I finish with this guy, I think. Damn it! <laughs> is he dead? He is! Wow, ow! I didn't see that. Damn you. Ooh. Is that sour milk? Breakfast! <laughs> HP up. Alright. That one over in the corner, you see, is a different color. Let's bomb it. And give myself some uh, some shields here. Oh. What's this up here? Oh, that's right. I unlocked uh, Monstro's Tooth uh, by battling around a bit. Messing around, making sure I could record this. So let's head up here. Um. This will cost me a heart, uh, so and this will cost me two hearts, so I'm just going to go for the one heart, because I don't know what either one of these does. Gives me a Ouija board, which gives me spectral tears. I don't, I don't know what the spectral tears does, but it took away my chocolate milk! That doesn't sound good. Alright, let's move on to the caves, level one. Oh, Mom, damn it! Mom, stop kicking me! Why is mom so fat? Oh, and I still kept the, the map! Nice! The map stayed between levels. Oh, look at that. How awesome that is. And I already found the boss. Uh, no, I don't care that much about the coin. I don't think I can get it anyway. Gluttony! Damn it, Gluttony! He's not that fat. Holy crap, look at that. Is that a reference to... Is that a reference to Full Metal Alchemist? I think it is. That little move there with Gluttony. Could be wrong, though. I could be wrong. And now I can't pick up the, uh, the hearts anymore. Once again, no point to the, uh, to the mini boss battle. At least that time for me. Not that time. Alright, hopefully I can find a bomb somewhere around here so I can get to the, the treasure room. Damn it. I, I had to get hit at least once there. Didn't have to get hit that many times, though. Damn it. Die. Stop trying to hit me. Die. Die. There we go. How am I going to get that? I think I need a bomb or something in order to get that. Damn it. Ah. So many freaking things of meat. Ah, I got a bomb. All right, let's go to the treasure room now. I think I have to stay away from my own bombs, otherwise they do hurt me. And in here I get a shovel. We need to go deeper. Uh, what does this do? Oh, it opens up 
Oh, why would I want to do that? No. I'm not trying to speedrun the game. I want everything on every level. Oh, I can go over the rocks now with my tears. That's what that did. Okay. I can use cover. Use cover. Uh, I need that one in the front to stand up. Why doesn't he get up? There we go. Alright, now... Once again, the one in the front, like, refuses to stand up. I don't know what their problem is, but I can't hit them like that, obviously. Otherwise, they'd be dead by now. Nope. Damn it. Alright, fine. I'm gonna have to just, like, wing it. No! Yes! Done! Completed! Very nice. I don't like those enemies. Oh, crap. We got freaking bumbleflies here. Oh, they turned into bombs. I see. Uh, no point in me going into the shop. But again, all this stuff, and I can't grab it because it's like out floating in the middle of nowhere. I still haven't gotten the, uh, the upgrade for this level yet. I'm looking forward to that. I still don't, I don't have a bomb. Damn it, give me the bomb! Oh, God. God. Damn it, you guys again. Yeah, they, they're, they're bombs. When you kill them, hooray! I want the upgrade to this place. Okay. Just hit one of them. There we go. <laughs> hit one of them and just cascade until they all die. Holy crap, we got maggots. Oh, these are the maggots from uh, Super Meat Boy, aren't they? I recognize them. Larry Jr. Jr. Um, Alright, just... Come on, Spectral Tears, you work for me. There we go. Grab a heart out of there, now I'm back to full health. And then over there better be the treasure room. Upgrade room, it is. Hooray, there is an upgrade room. I assume there's one on every floor. I haven't seen one without one yet. Um, I need a key. Luckily, I, it's my last one. Right, give me something good. I don't know what that is. It's a book of some kind. It's uh, the Book of Shadows. I don't know what that does. I'm going to try it on the boss. Hopefully that works out well for me. <laughs> uh, it could be awful. I don't know what any of this does bomb and a treasure chest that I can't get because I don't have a bomb. Alright, so there's a lot of stuff around here that I simply can't get. Hooray. And I can't even buy one in the shop even because nothing costs two. Alright, who do we have here? Isaac versus Gertie? What the fuck is a Gertie? Spacebar, go! Oh, it gives me like a shield? Is it permanent? Alright, let's get rid of this thing. These things are bad news. No, it's not permanent, but it was uh, indestructible for that little bit there. Do I still have, like, poison touch on me? Oh, crap. <laughs> nope, die. No, these things must die. These things are bad news. No, damn it. I'm almost dead. Damn it. <laughs> Gertie. Killed by Gertie. Well, that's going to do it for, for this part of uh, Ballard of Something Random, The Binding of Isaac. I will return to this game. Hopefully I can beat it, but this time I was beaten by Gertie, the monstrosity. What the hell is that thing? Hope you guys have enjoyed this part. Hope you laughed. Hope you learned. Hope to see you next time. Thanks for watching.